Can I have some? Um, 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 oh, look at them both, babe. You guys are so sweet. As we know, the holiday season is here and we're gonna be given our gifts soon. And nothing's worse than waiting last minute and then scrambling around to find the perfect gift to give someone. My number one goal with gift shopping for my friends and family is to give them a gift that they're actually going to use. I wanna show you guys my favorite products from Way. You guys know I've been using Way hair care all year and I'm so obsessed with it. Not only does it smell incredible, but it works so well for your hair. I always get compliments on my hair. My number one favorite product from way i've literally gone through four bottles of this it is my detox shampoo this is my number one step and it is a concentrated shampoo that cleanses product buildup hard water deposits dirt oil and other impurities it's also made with apple cider vinegar free of sulfates and parabens but with that shampoo you guys it just strips my hair of all of that gunk and oil so i can go so much longer without washing my hair a lot of you guys told me that you tried the detox shampoo and the same thing happened for you i think it would be a great idea to do like a little self-care gift so you can throw in that detox shampoo the scalp scrubber that i just used and then i'm going to show you guys some more products from way but also this is their medium hair conditioner but you could also do like their leave on mask you could also do their body wash everything from way just smells incredible like you can't go wrong with way these are some other great gift ideas this is their leave-in conditioner it helps with frizz tangles flyaways and breakage for all hair types and it also protects hair for heat up to 450 degrees and then another product i love from way is their hair oil and this is your fast fix for healthy hair it's a multitasking oil that smooths frizz and seals split ends for a high gloss super smooth finish y'all know i always gotta hook you up with the code so don't miss your chance to get away this holiday season by going to t-h-e-o-u-a-i dot com slash nozanine and enter promo code nozanine for 15% off site-wide that's 15% off your entire order at t-h-e-o-u-a-i dot com slash nozanine with code nozanine part about costco is the 20 approved carts i wish all shopping carts had this i know she's so excited look at the face Oh, oh my god, babe, they're moving it. Y'all, look at these crazy legs. <laughs> Mel with this camera. Babies! Hello! Oh my gosh, you guys. My purse down. Oh, that's too tight. Yeah. Too tight for Mooch. Oh my goodness, you made a mess, Moochie. Hey, curly twenties. Can't see. Guys, they are look. <laughs> oh my goodness. That's than you. Babe, their eyes got so big when they saw. Look, look, look. Look at how big this is compared to me. The kids have like a playroom or something, or we had a basement to put it in. Yeah. But like, where would we put this? I like the yellow one. The yellow like one's this nice. One. This one's We've been thinking about getting another TV, guys. We've had ours for a really long time, so we're just kind of like looking at them, trying to decide. So we're in between three TVs right now: LG, Samsung, and Sony. Pretty much the only three options. I know, but they're all. Like Vizios. They're all the same type of TV. The o what, OLED? O -L -E OLED, yeah. O -L -E We're up upgrading our family room TV, so it needs to be like, you know, top Crisp. of the line. This is like where we entertain people, watch movies and stuff. No, guys, our TV is bad because I'm looking at these other ones. Like, that's like what our TV looks like, like super muted. Compared to this, I feel like this is clearer than my eyesight. Well, we want to get that Cyber Monday deal, so what are we doing, babe? The sale is over today. Dude, them with their feet. I want to see you guys give each other hugs again, guys. They were giving each other hugs. Hug, hug, hug. Oh, look, look, look. See? They've been hugging each other all day. Y'all, this is why I like to do my grocery shopping online because I don't want to see these delicious things and not get them. Like, what? Babe, like, this looks impeccable. No, babe. No. Mel and I are trying to lose weight, so. 
Don't Probably listen to him. Probably year new us. So you want to wait till January? Yeah. No. Take it easy? Yes. Get the ravioli though. <laughs> Guys, you know the twins love their samples. And some of this. Ooh, they're gluten free. <laughs> what you eating, Mooch? Let me see. Can I have a bite? Can I have? Can I have some? Um, um, um. Um, 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 um. Um, oh, look at them both, babe. You guys are so sweet. Mm. Wait, did you see Dave's Killer Bread has white bread? Let's know. check the ingredients. Canola oil. Kai Kai, where's your shoes? Where's your shoes? Show me your shoes. Shoes? Good job. Witchy, where's your shoes? Where's your shoes? Which? Where's your shoes? Don't take it off. Where's your shoes? Oh. Uh -huh. Let me have these shoes. Let me have these shoes. Oh. Pop pop. Pop pop. Aww. Hug sissy. Hug sissy. Aww. Aww. Oh. Oh. We'll just try to give him a hug. Kaka, give me sissy a hug. Oh, goodness. Hey, hey, hey. Relax. Hi, Daddy. Snacking on one of these. What's up, you guys? I just pulled up to the nail salon, and today we're trying out a new salon. So Yvette found this place on TikTok, and we're going to try it out together. I just pulled up, so I'm about to go in, and she's going to meet me here, too. So I've just been having struggles with my nails, you guys. I go to the same place, and it's just like a regular salon, and I'm usually not too picky with my nails. I'm not going to say they're the most amazing at nails, um, but they're good for the most part. Like, I don't really have too many complaints. But this last time I went, I got a different person, and I'm not too picky with who I have there either I have a different person almost every time but this time whoever did my nails again if you follow me on snapchat you guys saw but I'll put some of the clips on the screen but whoever did my nails they made my nails look like they were two weeks old literally within two days my nails look like they were two weeks old they started the polish super far away from the cuticle so it just it didn't look good the shaping wasn't good so I decided to go somewhere else because I've had good experiences with Russian manicure so I'm like let me go to a Russian nail salon so I drove to Glendale tried out this Russian place and they told me because my gel X was fresh they didn't want to completely redo it they want to give me a gel fill so I was like, okay, whatever. So literally she just lays on top of the Gel X like gel polish. And guys, my nails, it just looked so thick and bubbly. Like I hate the way they look. So I literally got my nails done like two weeks ago and I'm ready to just like get them redone again. Not even two weeks, I think a week ago. And not only that, but I also left my Stanley at that nail salon. And I don't plan on going back to that nail salon. So I have to drive all the way out to that nail salon to get my cup. I'm using my little knockoff Stanley right now. Guys, the knockoff Stanleys are not the same, okay? I used to be that person who was like, why? Are people spending so much on a Stanley all tumbler cups are the same no there's a huge difference it's like this one just spills everywhere I need my Stanley back but anyways I'm going off on a tangent these nails need to go I'll give you guys an up-close look but they just look like bubbles like I hate it so much and I'm like I literally went to this place because it was a Russian manicure place and with Russian manicures your nails start so well like at the cuticle it looks like it's growing out of your nails you know but no these let me just show you guys. They're like so thick and bubbly. Like someone said on my Snapchat, they look like gum, like pieces of gum. You see? They're not terrible, but like, I don't know. You know, I took a picture of something the other day and you could really tell how bad my thumbnail was. So I'll put it on the screen. You guys can just see it's like thick pieces of gum. I can't. Let's go get these nails changed.
coming round now Winter is here My favorite time of the year I could get close to my dear, my baby I could feel a breeze coming through I could see, see me and you Cuddled up underneath the mistletoe Anything that you want just let me know And we can go High as the moon High as the skies above I swear it won't take long But you too come around and fall in love This fog is way too thick I can't even see you there Cuddle up, put it in the air Christmas trees, we don't need Let's just bake and roll these leaves Let me take your stress away It's the Hot Pucks Holiday Just got our drinks. I got a matcha. I got a honey vanilla latte. Guys, Mel literally walks around town with this big. People are gonna think you're paparazzi, babe. So we're here at one of our favorite. I want to say breakfast spots, but we come like all day, y'all. You guys know we love Earth, but we haven't been here in a minute, huh, babe? Yeah. You haven't had Earth in forever. I had Earth in Vegas, but. Yeah, we wanted to get out the house, and I was like, you know what? We haven't had Earth in a minute, so let's go get some. Nope. Kai Kai wants the latte. It's mine. Mooch stole my clip. It's hot. Hot. Or food Hot. Hello. Let's do the pizza right here. Oh, wait. You got two? You got two? Yeah. You got the same thing? Baby, he just said pizza. Thanks. Turns out Mel and I got the same thing. He wants to be me. I literally put you on to this. Place. I know you did. Ah, Kai is gonna grab it. Mm. For the babies, we got mac and cheese, and we love that it always comes with like this little side of fruit. Super cute. Can you put more food on there. Then guys, Mel and I are trying this today. This is their waffle. What was it? The banana walnut waffle. This is our little dessert, our little something sweet. Pops is being stubborn. Yeah. I'm trying to put more food on his fork, but he won't give me his fork. Look at these two little pigeons. What's up, you guys? I just wanted to end this vlog chatting with y'all. And I'm filming this portion the day I'm uploading this video. So today is December 1st, which means it's my birthday month. I'm so excited. Guys, I'm very much not the type of person who'd be like, it's my birthday month, my birthday week. Like I pretty much just celebrate my birthday and then like move on. But this year is different, y'all. I'm turning 25 this year, which is just crazy to even hear that number. Like to me, like 25, like it doesn't sound old. Like 25 is still so young. But especially because you guys know Paul and Isha, all of our birthdays are in the same week. Um, they're my two closest friends from back home. We were talking about it and we're all like, can you guys believe we're 25? Like just yesterday, we were all like 15, 16 years old in high school. And it's just, it's so crazy. So for me, turning 25 is a big deal. And not only that, just like on my past birthdays, my 21st birthday, I was six months pregnant. My 22nd birthday was during COVID. My 23rd birthday, what did I do my 23rd birthday? What did I do my 23rd birthday? My 23rd was cool. I went to Vegas with Paul and Isha, but I don't think I did anything. I think I just did like a small dinner with friends here. I don't really think I did anything big. My 24th was really fun. We did an intimate dinner at one of my favorite restaurants, Cara Hotel here in LA. So that was super cool. I've never done like a big birthday party. So I'm like, you know what? This is the year, this is a milestone birthday. I'm a quarter of a century old. So why not go all out and do a birthday party? I decided on doing a birthday party. I also love how all of our events have been turning out. You guys know we did the twins birthday party. We did Mel's birthday recently. So I was like, you know what? Like I want a big celebration. And guys, it's going to be huge, okay? Paul is flying out, Isha's flying out, Yasmin's flying out. I'm just so, so excited. And I'm doing a few other things for my birthday too. So this is my like first year I'm really going all out for my birthday. Like party, bus, club, another club, another club, plane, next place, no sleep. Like that's the type of vibe I'm on this year. So just December is like super busy for me, but not in like a bad way, like in a good way, it's busy. Like I'm gonna be doing like a birthday shoot, my birthday celebration, lots of beauty appointments. Like I need to get my hair cut, touch up on my fillers. 
birthdays, all those things. So you guys are going to see all that. But I'm just really, really excited. Even my last birthday, like I was freshly postpartum. Like I just gave birth at the end of August and you know, my birthday is in December. So I was still breastfeeding and stuff. So I'm just so excited. Like this year, I really feel like I'm going to like celebrate my birthday. So with that, with planning a party comes finding a venue. Um, I do have a pretty big guest list, so I needed a bigger space. So I did go and tour a venue this morning and I wanted to share it with you guys and get your opinion on it. So I'm gonna go ahead and insert those clips and do a little voiceover, but you guys know Elegancia does all of our events, so they're gonna be handling, you know, all the nitty gritty stuff. But here's a venue that I'm looking at. So let me know your guys' opinions down below in the, in the description box, in the comments. All right, y'all, let's get into this house tour. Now I will say this house looked so much bigger in person versus online, so I was so happy about that. Like I mentioned, I did have a big guest list, so I was worried that this place would be too small, but in person, guys, it is huge. So here's the kitchen area. And then here is the outdoor area. We're probably gonna set up like the food and stuff here. This right here is the star of the show and it's like this pool area that it has. And I love how it looks at night. I'll show you guys a picture, but it like lights up at night, looks super cool. I wanted to show you guys the bedrooms even though the party isn't gonna be in the bedrooms, but pretty much it's four bedrooms and all three of them look like that first one. But then here is the master. What's cool about this bedroom is that the bathroom is connected to the backyard. I do like that there's another way to get in the house because you guys saw the way the pool was shaped. It's like easier than having to go around the pool. So then through those sliding doors, you get back to the outdoor area. And I don't know if I can say this on YouTube, but this is gonna be the H-O-O-K-A-H area. <laughs> but yeah, guys, that's the tour. Yeah, guys, let me know what you think of the house down below. I'm just so, so excited. So stay tuned for a lot of birthday content. And y'all also know that I've been doing $100 Amazon gift card giveaways in every video. I usually post it on Instagram, but Instagram has been acting a little weird with me doing giveaways. So to enter, all you guys need to do for this video is comment down below your Zodiac sign and also your dream birthday celebration. So whether that's you know, doing a big party, going on vacation, going on a trip. Just let me know like what's your perfect birthday down below. Make sure you guys are subscribed and like this video as well and stay tuned for a bunch of birthday content. So thanks so much for watching you guys and I'll see you again for my next video. Bye y'all.